the brain aneurysm is a dilation, almost like a balloon of a vessel within the brain. And as the vessel gets bigger, the wall becomes thinner and that increases the risk of rupture. And when it ruptures, you suffer from subarachnoid hemorrhage, blood that surrounds the brain. You could also have blood within the brain and also you can have blood within the ventricles in the brain. Things that actually increase your risk of aneurysm formation are cigarette smoking, use of nicotine and tobacco products, uncontrolled high blood pressure, certain illicit drugs like marijuana, cocaine, and family history of aneurysms. If you have any of these high risk factors, it's important that you get checked out by your physician. Get either a CT angiogram or an MR angiogram. That's a non-invasive angiographic study that looks at the vessels in the brain and the neck. And if need be, we can always consider a catheter-based diagnostic angiogram. So for preventative measures that can be taken, you know your body the best, so always stay in tune with your body. If anything feels off or feels different, always have a low threshold for seeking medical help. And also make sure that you are eating healthy and uh, exercising and avoiding smoking. And also treating any other medical problems you might have, such as high blood pressure, diabetes, high cholesterol. And if you have intracranial aneurysms, please let us know and we'd love to take care of you. 